People have been wondering what they should do since Trump has been elected. Here are five thoughts. My name is Opal Tometi. I'm a human rights activist, co-founder of Black Lives Matter, and the director for the Black Alliance for Just Immigration. First, let's nourish ourselves with words from our ancestors. Ella Baker tells us, we, we who believe in freedom, believe in freedom cannot, cannot rest. rest. Sitting Bull says, let us put our minds together to see what kind of future we can make for our children. And Grace Lee Bogg says, Building community is to the collective as spiritual practice is to the individual. Second, let's remain explicit that we are fighting for racial justice with an intersectional lens. We will center and show up for Black, Brown, Native, Muslim, Immigrant, LGBTQ, folks with records, folks with disabilities, and poor communities. And we will defend ourselves from fascism, violence, rhetoric, and policies that harm us. Third, we'll resist corporate takeovers of Mother Earth and what is sacred. And we'll work to make visible the sovereignty of Native people like the water protectors and our kin in Flint. Fourth, we must perfect the art of organizing people in person and in public spaces. If you aren't organized, find your people. Fifth, we must know our rights. Our organizations and First Amendment right to assemble have been threatened. Organizers have been jailed, and we are living under extreme surveillance in a national security state. We must ensure our security online and offline. If you're white, your work is to organize other white people to donate and challenge white supremacy. And if you find yourself in melanin spaces, learn to take direction from us. We'll show you when and how we need your support. We must not rest until we build a multiracial democracy that embraces the fullness of our spirits and human experience. <laughs>